Hey you guys, Jen here. I am coming to you from Dubrovnik, Croatia. And today we are going on a mini adventure to Lokrum Island. It's just a 10 minute ferry ride across to the island. Just grab the ferry boat at the old port in the center of Dubrovnik. Sit back and enjoy the ride over to the island. And yes, the water really is that color. There are informative maps all around the island. All right, you guys, we are here on Lokrum. Now there's a few things that we want to get accomplished while we're here. I'm really excited to see some peacocks and giant bunny rabbits. They're supposed to be all around the island. Also, we're here to check out the nude beach. This is like the closest nude beach to Dubrovnik, so of course we had to make sure to check it out. A few other little interesting things about the island. Back in 1192, it's said that Richard the Lionheart was shipwrecked here on his way back from one of his crusades. and. He basically, the legend goes that he said he would build a church wherever he landed safely, if he would make it out alive, I guess. And since he landed here, he wanted to build a church here. But the folks in Dubrovnik, they really wanted a church in the town on the mainland. So they asked him, if we promise to build a church here on this island for you, would you just at least right now build a church on the mainland? And that's what happened. Port Royal, it's on the right, the Olive Grove, the Path of Paradise, the Church of Annunciation, and the Botanical Garden, it's all to the right. All right, let's check those out. Uh, and then on the left, we have the Dead Sea and the Gardens of Maximilian. Uh, the Gardens of Maximilian, right. It's a peacock with her baby. Hi, sweetheart. Well, aren't you a pretty girl? Oh, the columns. Oh yeah, I want to see the sign. There's a big sign about okay. all about it. Look at all of them. Uh -huh. And then we'll come right back. It's the whole family. This is like chickens in Hawaii. Yeah. <laughs> what was it, on, on the big island or It was on Hawaii. 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 Hey there, little family. Hey, Peacock family. How you doing? Hi. All right, actually, this was the palace of Archduke Maximilian of the Habsburgs. The Austrian Imperial Dynasty was closely connected to the island of Lokrum. In fact, when in May of 1859, the warship Triton sunk near Lokrum, Maximilian, as the commander-in-chief of the Austrian Navy, came to investigate the reason for the accident. When he saw the beauty of Lokrum, he and his wife decided to buy the island, landscape the grounds, and build one of their residences here. There is said to be a curse on anyone who would own the island of Lokrum. Maximilian was executed in Mexico, while other owners either met untimely deaths or financial ruin. That's right, you guys. You can sit on the Iron Throne from Game of Thrones here at the palace. They also have some additional information about Game of Thrones and the filming locations in Dubrovnik. The island of Lokrum was protected under the Nature Protection Act in the category of a special reserve of forest vegetation in 1948. Due to its value and category of protection, the forest of the island of Lokrum is a special purpose forest whose main beneficial function is linked to an increased impact on biodiversity. All right, so the whole thing about there being a lot of peacocks is totally true. 
they're just everywhere. Like, I don't know if you can see, there's a little guy right here, like, nestled in the bushes. So we saw picnic tables, uh, quite a number of picnic tables, actually. So benches. Benches, seating, trash receptacles. So if you want to pack your lunch and bring it over for picnic style, it's perfect. Finally, we see a bunny. Hi, bunny rabbit. Hello. So also smoking is not allowed on the island at all. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but the sound of the cicada oh, for sure it is. is almost deafening. Yeah. Port Royal, let's go see it. Steep hill and stairs. Yeah. I'll be rewarded when once we start swimming. <laughs> Almost there. We think of parts of the Caribbean. Yeah. <laughs> well. Very cool view. Look at that. Guys, if you're gonna hike up to this fortress fort, you need to be in really good shape. It is really quite physically challenging, but the views from up top are pretty awesome. rough seas today. If you can see behind me, I have no idea how I'm going to get into the water. I'm going to go see. I think Milos is giving it a shot over there. Now we're gonna go try and find the Dead Sea, which is the internal saltwater lake on the island, which is apparently really great for swimming. But you have to wear your bathing suit. Thank God they have signs everywhere because it's easy to get lost. I'm going this way. We found it. <laughs>
While there are no sandy beaches here at Lokrum, you have some rocks and tide pools which makes for an easy swimming area. You also have a nice manicured area where you can sun and enjoy the side of the rocky beach with more peacock friends, of course. They also have sports fields set up, so if the kids want to play some soccer, football, volleyball, it's right all there. Football, not soccer. Now, if you're looking for a place to eat, if you don't want to bring your own food, there are several options on the island where you can grab food and drink set up really really nicely anyway all right you guys i hope you have enjoyed this visit to Lokrum island it's a fun place it's a really great day trip so if you're staying in the dubrovnik area long enough i highly recommend it it's fantastic now you guys if you haven't done so already please subscribe to our channel and more importantly please hit that like button and leave a comment have you been here to Lokrum island we'd love to hear about your experiences Anyway, you guys, have an awesome day, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.